Hey guys, Jewelfish here. Welcome back to a brand new episode of Minecraft OP Prison here today on jewelfish.akumamc.net, guys. It has been a fat freaking minute since I've recorded any Minecraft or uploaded here on the channel, and I know the upload schedule has been super inconsistent, guys, but maybe this is finally a return. We'll have to see when it comes into what the uploads are looking like a week from now, but what matters now is that we got a video on the way as we're speaking guys in today's video we are going to be going over and starting up here on the server for the first time in a while and i think i'll just be kind of playing my own way in today's video kind of opening some monthly crates here and there showing you guys my starter strategies here on minecraft op prison what i do this time on akuma and i can't believe guys i'm pretty sure this is season 14 we're actually getting started on yeah guys this is insane guys i remember joining akuma like season three or so and here we are season 14 the server's grown a crazy amount there's literally 200 people online on a freaking monday guys which is pretty crazy the server just reset so if you guys want to hop on as you're watching this video it will be a fresh server and you'll have a chance to compete with everyone else guys and trust me my commentary skills might be a little rough since it's been a minute since i've done this guys I'll stop procrastinating and rambling on. Let's get into the meat of today's video. So guys, since this is kind of my server, I am a media owner here on the server. We obviously get to start off with our own P mine. I just type slash P mine claim. And a P mine is basically your very own mine that you get at the start of the season and can mine with it yourself. Normally you have to buy on the store, but since I'm partnered here with Akuma and I'm a media owner, I kind of get one for free as I start out here, guys. So obviously this is where I'm going to start mining. And you guys just saw me mine my first blocks of the season right here. And as you guys can see, we're already making tokens like akuma comes with token miner on the pickaxe and all that which makes it super op and uh yeah we're gonna be getting into even more of that stuff in like, just a moment when you start on on akuma you really won't have much other than token miner one on your pickaxe so you're gonna want to mine a few blocks and as you guys can see i've already made 50 million tokens right now you can already right click your pickaxe and get a few levels of token miner and already start multiplying the amount of tokens that you make when you mine but token miner 11 is not going to be helping us to get to slash yt top against all the other youtubers and slash prestige top if you guys don't know on minecraft op prison the main goal is to prestige and get to the top of the slash prestige top menu as you guys can see there is someone on here with 227 million prestiges and the server only started three days ago which means we gotta get our grind on and start getting millions worth of prestiges now prestiges here on akuma is basically how you rank up it's how you grind up and like level yourself up as a player here on prison and that's really the main goal of the game so obviously you could vote for the server and start grinding up your pickaxe just by mining a ton of blocks but me myself I'm going to give myself a little bit of a boost. I'm going to give myself a few month crates to go ahead and get us our, ourselves started. And then I'm going to show you guys what I normally buy on my pickaxe when I start out here. Now here on Akuma, there are items you can buy on the online store, which does cost in real life money. But some of the items can be really OP and good. But do not feel forced, guys. Akuma is actually one of the least pay to win prison servers I think I've ever played. So in that regards, I don't know if you need to buy this stuff. But if you guys are feeling it, you guys can check out the Jewelfish crate on store.akumamc.net. I do get a percentage of the sale and it is a great way to directly support my series and the channel guys i appreciate it like crazy i had a crazy stream the other day where a ton of you guys cop these and i just appreciate everyone who's ever copped one a ton you guys are absolute legends and i love you all so much and the month crate of course this one's about ten dollars the jewelfish crate about five dollars so yeah these things give some insane rewards like top ranks like the akuma plus rank which is worth three hundred dollars and the jewelfish crate with the akuma rank the second top rank which is worth two hundred dollars for only five dollars guys so hopefully we can win some insane rewards rewards but right now i think i need the token rewards and the key rewards the most because we want to get grinding up on our pickaxe that way we can get some more procedures and that way we can dominate yt top even faster than before all right i guess there's no need to keep procrastinating here we're gonna open up all the month crates just like that one two three four i think we're gonna start off with the october crate so save the luck for the jewelfish crates finally at the end but hopefully we don't win anything too amazing because i want to save my luck for the jewelfish crates you got two rank keys right there ladies and gentlemen got 10 mythical keys and more mythical cool keys right there that is absolutely amazing we got some dying ranks right there and uh sorry for that sound we do have 320 billion tokens now and another five month crates to pop open here so this is just a nice little small star i am a bit behind of the season so this is quite beta win and op for myself firstly i like to grind sometimes but when you're starting out it's really tedious but trust you guys once you get through you start getting billions and millions worth of tokens everything starts to go 
up and there you go we just got a god rank from a single month grade this rank is worth about 60 dollars and the month grade itself only costs 10 dollars now later on in the series guys there are tons of way to get these month grades that i'm opening right now for free and you guys will eventually be able to get your very own god ranks for free actually most people on the server never even bought their rank or the monthly crates that they open yeah akuma is pretty wild like that like people do not spend a dollar on here and they can be the top akuma plus rank and have like millions and billions worth of prestiges and here we are with the legendary the mythical the amazing jewelfish crates guys i've already explained this i do get a percentage of sale great way to directly support the channel and obviously since they are my very own crates you know i'm the goat i'm the greatest of all time so these crates are the greatest of all time guys we're gonna pop these open right now we are hopefully going to get some good rewards right now ladies and gentlemen from the jewelfish crates of course and we're gonna open five at a time see what we pull here and as you guys can see we already got a free rank using the rank key i'm actually gonna go type slash keys see what rank we would have got from that okay only a lord rank nothing too amazing and uh sadly we did not win much else except for tokens and more tokens that is kind of an f right there f kind of stands for like fail or press f to pay respects if you guys know the meme that i'm talking about so yeah we're gonna open another five of these hopefully we get some better rewards like the akuma rank or an overlord rank that would absolutely pop off for the video out as you guys can see god rank in the rotation right there ladies and gentlemen sadly not we got another jewelfish crate from the opening another rank key and some more mythical keys but hey thankfully we got a 25 dollar legacy rank in another rank key that we can go ahead and open from the jewelfish crate let's see what we get from this and a titan rank that's kind of unfortunate and okay the final jewelfish crate ladies and gentlemen this will determine if the jewelfish crates are good or not although i don't really know if i want to do that and put it all in one thing but uh you guys see an overlord rank in the rotation oh okay okay we got the 60 dollar god rank from a five dollar crate i think the jewelfish crates have officially redeemed themselves for today's video guys i think that's enough in my opinion guys i know a lot of you on the server are going to be asking me if i can give out the ranks or any month crates to you guys or even like tokens sadly most of the time i will not be able to as these month crates were spawned in for me and they're literally just to make content and like help me out when i'm getting started here on a Kuma. I'm sorry guys, but uh, I just can't give out free like hundred dollar ranks, but I appreciate you guys watching either way uh, Yeah, there's there's no way to say it with a like sounding a bit mean So now we're absolutely stacked up and we have 1.5 a trillion tokens here on the server We got 1500 blocks mine 1600 now. We're actually kind of popping off already We are going to go ahead and max out our token miner for 2k levels Actually, we're not going to do that The first thing you always want to do when you're starting out on a Kuma if you have no tokens is get max key finder just grind for that and get a few levels of token miner i would evenly upgrade token miner and key finder just a ton until you like you have quite a few levels and all that guys because uh key finder when you start mining as you guys will see in the chat we will start to receive keys now keys will actually get you billions of tokens right when you're starting out if you type such keys even if you're getting like minor keys and stuff there are insane rewards in here like 125 million tokens which will slowly stack up to billions like if you have five minor keys and you open them that's like half a billion tokens right there in like one second if you get a single proc on key finder i think you guys are kind of getting where i'm coming from i'm just explaining that the key finder the more keys you get the more tokens you get like and it multiplies the more key finder you have it's just absolutely insane so definitely when you're starting out get a few levels of token miner a few levels of explosive and max out key finder and i would just keep grinding those until you finally max out explosive and that's what i'm going to do now guys the reason you always max out explosive is because token miner works with explosive so once you have the max token miner and max explosive you will be making tons worth of tokens and as you guys can see i'm just absolutely trenching massive holes in the mine as we speak with this explosive in chain with that you're going to want to start upgrading token miner and now you have the ultimate duo to start making the most amount of tokens when you're starting out here on akuma obviously later on we're gonna have to turn off explosive but i won't really get into that in today's video because that gets a bit complicated but basically token merchant does not work with explosive so then you have to turn off explosive then you can go back to chill mining but for now we're going to be digging absolute craters in the mine i'm also going to let myself get a few levels of haste and speed here that way we just mine a bit faster and the speed should to help us out and there we go we are already trenching through the mines and this is like a freaking modded minecraft the way you just make holes i'd also recommend getting a few levels of lucky when you're starting out don't spend too much on this like once you have a ton of tokens lucky should come easily and i wouldn't really focus on it too much it's basically an extra boost on key finder that allows you to find more keys so it's nothing too incredible i'm actually kind of getting bored of this block like mine color so guys what i'm gonna actually gonna do is type slash p mine and we're gonna change our block this is a cool feature of p mines you can actually change the block that your p mine is and right now i'm kind of feeling a full emerald and then we type slash p mine space or reset jewelfish i think and then we will see 
if the mine will it will obviously turn emerald and i think that's just gonna look a lot nicer for now for today's video but now what i gotta do guys with the max explosive the reason max explosive is also really good is your pickaxe level guys you need to get pickaxe level 150 to be able to access all enchants including prestige enchants like look at this you need pickaxe level 100 150 and all that guys that's gonna take you a while to get so explosive actually helps you get pickaxe exp faster which means you'll reach the higher pickaxe level even faster than before if you guys are mining in a p mine for your like pickaxe levels and all that i would actually recommend going to an even bigger mine i mean i have access to the akuma plus mine but some really big mines are like slash warp donator and you guys can actually float to the bottom and these mines are actually really big and will help you get your explosive levels and pickaxe levels faster because there's just way more blocks to mine for way longer in a p mine the mines are a lot shorter like look at how long i've been mining for like look at how long that freaking took me to mine across from so yeah the p mines are way shorter and less longer so going to a big mine may actually help you with your pickaxe levels but it'll make you less money now since we kind of popped off with the month grade openings guys that means we'll have a ton of keys to open we already have 327 seasonal keys which has a chance of loot boxes and pumpkins in there we'll be getting into what pumpkins do in a later episode but basically guys i'm pretty sure these are like the keys to getting the free month crates that i was opening at the start of the video but anyways guys we already have 30 mine crates you got 2300 token keys oh my goodness four rank keys and 1500 omega keys 86 mythicals which have a 0.8 percent chance of giving you the month grade guys so we're gonna start off with the token keys we now have 299 billion 30 mine keys 13 level keys which isn't much but uh yeah let's get these open oh, okay we have to wait like five seconds every time okay we got some omega keys let's open those up we got two loot boxes and some donator ranks nothing amazing 332 seasonal and it looks like all these keys are gone so now we just have the mythicals and seasonals to get through pop open the seasonal keys got one more loot box i believe and uh yeah we are already almost at another one trillion tokens which is actually pretty cracked and uh, okay looks like everything else but the mythical keys are open let's see if we win another month credit for the video sadly we did not but statistically we should have because it is a 0.8 percent chance sometimes you get very lucky with those and you'll get like three or four from a hundred mythical keys but most of the time you'll probably get zero you just have to pray that your luck is good loot boxes are like a really terrible version of the month crate i mean you open them and you get three little things and it's like 750 build tokens and eight mythical keys like it's pretty trash guys so normally i just spam them open just like that and we got some free ranks in here i'm gonna have to store these away that way i don't accidentally end up giving them out but yeah now we have a spare one trillion tokens just from opening a ton of keys and trust me guys key finder will get you that many keys if you keep grinding here on the server i've done a video where i've opened over a hundred thousand keys here on the server without like month grade boosting or anything like that like most of the keys in that video were from me straight up mining and like just going for the keys like i've definitely mined over a, a million keys at least here on akuma in the entire year and a half i've probably played by now i'm telling you guys like just just get key finder and lucky and, and you'll pop off and, and and you'll get a ton of token all right with the one trillion tokens we have now i'm gonna go ahead and get another 900 levels of token miner and now we almost have token miner max out so if we head back to the p mine we should start making a huge bank right now if we mine a few blocks we're already back up to a billion tokens two billion yeah the numbers are really starting to tick up here count up like crazy and uh you know i'm actually really liking the look of this right now we are already going crazy and i'm going to drop 14 million tokens on fortune and i'm going to mine for a bit guys see how much money we can make and see if we can pass anyone on yt top because there's a few people on here that i feel like we could pass maybe mesoid i don't know yeah uh, we'll see it definitely could pass uh resucting and generous on maybe in today's video because we already got 500k prestigious so yeah let's let's look forward to that maybe for today's video guys today's video is really just the start of a ton of things we have coming this season here on akuma obviously i didn't really even show a ton of the features here on akuma like the weekly prizes that you guys can literally make in real life money from playing minecraft op prison grind into the top got daily rewards over here and there's just a ton of stuff you guys can do there's the akuma pass and there is like tutorials and everything guys there is so much we have to get into as you guys can see there are like three other current series that i barely even touched on in today's video guys so make sure to stay tuned for the rest of the season and make sure to smash that subscribe button make sure those bells are set to all because uh jewelfish may be making a huge return very soon all right guys so it has been a minute and i have consistently kept mining and upgrading my token miner and fortune here guys we now have fortune 52,658 and one sextillion dollars to my name here on the server after mining quite a bit and got 
guys i think this should be enough to go ahead and pass a few of the lower tier youtubers here on freaking yt top the ones i haven't proceed as much not lower tier i meant like on the prestige top leaderboard guys so we are going to go ahead and type slash max prestige and this basically guys how you get the most out of your prestiges and money just like that and we're at 1.1 million and we don't have really any money left guys so if we type slash yt top we are just about passing resucting and super close to beating generous on you know what guys i think i'm gonna mind a bit more get just enough to pass generous on that way we can say we beat him in today's video guys and then i'll bring you guys back once we finally did that all right guys so we have another half a sextillion dollars to work with i don't know if i just voice cracked there but here we go we're gonna type slash max prestige just like that ladies and gentlemen and oh my gosh if we are not beating generous on <gasps> oh my god we are so freaking close to beating him i can't believe i just freaking missed out all right a couple hundred more quintillion guys let's type slash max prestige and there we go guys 1.4 million oh my gosh we are 40,000 short are you kidding me i'm not even doing this on purpose guys i have no idea how much it's actually gonna give me just let me mine a few more blocks get more money and just finally beat this guy so i can say i beat generous on in today's video that's all that freaking matter all right max for siege okay one point no way I need another 13,000, guys. I finally thought we did it. Okay, Max Prestige, come on. Oh my gosh, 4,000 away. Come on, we're counting up thousands of Prestiges like it's nothing. Come on, just give me it, give me it. Come on, Max Prestige, one more time. And no way. Is that like the exact same? Okay, we're, we're 200 behind him right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Max Prestige. And there we go. We are officially beating Generous on for today's video, guys. Mission freaking complete. I wasn't even doing that on purpose, guys. But other than that, guys, I think that's going to be it for today's first episode back here on Akuma, guys. Yeah, I know I've done a lot of first video backs, but I, I have a good feeling with this one. We'll have to see as time goes on, though. But I, I, we'll, we'll, we'll definitely see once this one goes out how I'm feeling and all that, guys. And uh, yeah, hopefully this Akuma season is finally the one we make a turn for the Jolfa channel for the better. Or that, guys. I hope you enjoyed the rest of the Akuma series, guys. If you are new here, make sure to scroll down there, tap that big, great, beautiful like button, and turn it blue, guys. 50% of people that don't smash like don't have a good day, so you do not want to take that 50% risk, guys. Of course, I'm bringing that back. And, uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you watched this part of the end, comment down below, hashtag Jewelfish is back as one word, just like that. And uh, I'll be hard in all the comments out of sight because that would be absolutely amazing if I do say so myself. But other than that, I love you all. Once again, you are all so amazing. I love you so much. And uh, you are all amazing, beautiful people. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. Peace out, home dog. I love you guys.